Hi friends and welcome to Little Woods Art. Today I'm going to show you how to make this commemorative 2020 stay at home lantern. So what you're going to need is a jar, either a spaghetti jar, or pickle jar. This is a good chance to reuse and reduce and recycle. And you'll need some Mod Podge. If you don't have Mod Podge, you can get some Elmer's glue and thin it with a little bit of water because we're going to use it to stick everything onto the jar. Now I had my children, I asked them the question, what do you think of when we had this stay at home? It's kind of a sad time, but it's also kind of a fun time. And I said, what comes to mind? Can you draw me some little drawings? And this is what they came up with. My son drew a controller because he likes to game. My daughter drew this no prom because she's a teenager and of course they had to cancel prom. And my other daughter thought of springtime and nature walks and going outside so she drew this bird and a flower. I also thought it would be neat to just put some words so I wrote some words that are meaningful to our family. And of course you've got to put 2020 somewhere on there. Then um, I would suggest that you get some tissue paper or any kind of paper, or you can even watercolor paper. And I just use tissue paper and cut out some hearts that you can glue on to overlap because you wanna add some color to the jar. So let's get started. Open up your Mod Podge. And take a brush. And what you want to do is paint a very thin layer, just enough to keep whatever you're putting on there to stick. And I would not paint the whole jar, just do a little section at a time because this sometimes dries really fast. Okay, I'm going to put this big heart here. And once you put whatever you want down, on there, you also want to paint another thin layer over the top of it. You don't want big clumps. If you have big clumps, it won't be very translucent. So try to paint it on evenly and smoothly, but you have to have a gentle touch if you have tissue paper because it will rip. Okay. Then I'm going to put this 2020 on there. Now, if your family took a porch picture, this would be a great place to put on a family picture. That's my family. Oops, I need a little more underneath because it's not sticking. And then just paint that on. Great, now you do that all the way around. Just. Keep overlapping and painting. If you have fabric you want to put on there, that would be great too. Then when you are all finished with the painting, you want to let it dry. But I suggest that you would make maybe a ribbon that you could put on top, just to decorate the very lip of the jar. Or if you have at home maybe some Christmas ribbon. I like to use whatever I have at home. You can tie that around the top and curl it, oops, this is a great project to do as a family. And then whenever you look at this jar, you can think about the fun time you had making it. Okay, and then if you use a real candle that's a little dangerous, I suggest you go get an LED candle like this. You can turn it on or off with the switch at the bottom and just drop that in. And then especially at night, you can put these outside on your deck um, as you're sitting out there or you can put it at the center of your table and it will just bring to mind that though this is a crazy time, we will all get through this and we need to encourage and, and hope and trust that things will get better. I hope you had fun today. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel, Little Woods Art, and I hope you have a great day. Goodbye.